What's up guys, it's me Omar from buymeaniphone.com. Today I have a really cool product I wanna show you. This is the product that you can purchase at mygearstore.com and it is the Switch Easy Odyssey case. A really cool, awesome case. And I've been uh, testing it out and playing with it for a little bit and I definitely think that you guys will get a kick out of this case. Let me go ahead and show you all the extras uh, that come with this case because I don't think there's any other company that includes this many extras with their products. So first we have the uh, case right here. We'll pop this out. Right there and there's the box right there I don't think there's anything else inside here except for just a little bit of information on the back besides that I think that is it yep that's it okay let's push this this box to the side so let's go ahead and open this up and show you all the little pieces that come inside this whole thing here so what included with this is two docks that you can use for the with, with the with the iPhone in the case so uh, uh, obviously whenever you have a sound dock or a stereo um, it comes with docks, but those are usually for the to be used with the iPhone without a case on it. So, the average uh, the average dock will probably be able to you could probably snap these into this because most of those are universal fit. So you can use either one of these, a black or a white one. Like if you have an iHome dock that has one of these little slots in there, swap it out and you can use it. So now you can keep your iPhone in the case and use it with the uh, the sound the sound dock there. Really awesome little extra that they throw in there. And there's another thing in here as well. There's a couple pieces. Let me pull these out. Oops, sorry, there we go. And so we have a little user manual, get that out of the way. We have a dust cover for the ports. We have two of them, two white ones. So we got uh, two for the headphone jack, uh, to plug up the headphone jack, and two to plug up the bottom 30 pin connector so no dust or water get into there. And then we have a little stand here so you can use this with the case when you wanna watch your videos. You can do that in uh, landscape or in portrait as well. If I can get it without actually probably, yeah, it kind of fits. It fits perfectly with the case on. So if I do it with the iPhone, it's going to topple back backwards with the within portrait mode. But you get the idea. So it's basically a little plastic stand you can use with that. Okay. So that's what comes in this little box right here. But also over here is included. They have the screen. Oops, sorry. They have the uh, two screen protectors. I believe it is. Let me double check that. Actually, I only see one screen protector, and they have the microfiber and the squeegee as well so you can put those that screen protector on your iphone without having any air bubbles so that, that's what's included there and it does have an additional back panel so as you can see here that it does have a gray but if you want the white on white stormtrooper style swap it out and you can use the white instead of the gray so an additional back plate and so guys this thing retails for 30 bucks and i, I just think it's ridiculous that they give they include all these things with a 30 dollar case you usually don't see that even with some 50 dollar cases but I've really enjoyed using this case and it, I think it's super nice. Switch Easy usually does a really good job of all their cases and um, the Odyssey is, is uh, no exception to that. So let's go ahead and pop it in here. Let me show you exactly how it fits. So we have this first part here, which is a silicone shell and this is not a gummy, sticky type of silicone. It's like really, um, it's shiny, it's hard to explain. It's real smooth, okay? Not your average type of, a, it's almost like a polymer, I would say. I'm not sure if I would even call it silicone, but it does, it does stretch. So you stretch it onto there like that Make sure it's all snug and nice and fit. Take this little back piece you have right here, pop it into the back. I'll keep, I'll keep the, uh, the gray on white look. And then you pop the bottom in like this, and then you try to have to clip it. Actually, the buttons on top should start first. Let's do that again. So let's start with the buttons on top, and then you hook that to the bottom right here. So once you have that on the bottom, everything lines up good. Make sure it's nice, snug, and fit. And there you go. So now it's on the case. Really good shock absorption, good protection, has that silicone, so it's definitely not gonna, I don't, I think it'll, if you drop it from like a waist high or so, it'll probably bounce off the floor and probably won't do any kind of damage at all to it. Um, let's do the accessibility check here real quick. Standby switch is covered up with the button here, but you can still feel the click when you click on it, very nice. Headphone jack, the opening's a little bit small, so some of your plugs may not fit in there, just keep in mind. The secondary microphone is not being blocked off though, and even with the dust plug that you can put in here, it, it still has an opening so that the second uh, microphone is not being blocked off, okay? Get to the side here, we have our switch right here. This pers this one I have here right now uh, will not work with the Verizon one uh, perfectly, it will be, the, the switch will be slightly off. Uh, I'm not sure if they have uh, plans to make a, a different version with a larger opening, so we'll be able to work with the Verizon phone. Remains to be seen. Don't quote me on that, but I believe they probably will have one that works for both of them. So then we have the volume rocker up and down. That is covered up with these rubber nubs, but you can still kind of feel the click through whenever you're messing with that. Get to the bottom. Very small opening here. This probably will only fit those connectors that are small, like the 30-pin connector that came with your iPhone. The larger square ones that some uh, devices use will not probably fit in here very well. 
Uh, for example, the one in my vehicle will not fit in here. I have to use an adapter with it. So one thing to keep in mind, two separate holes for the microphone and the speaker as well. Get to the bottom here. The home button is not being covered up. Nice big opening to the very top of here as well. All open space. It does have a slight lip to it. If you can see that right there on the edge. So you can, you can lay it on its face and it's not touching the glass, which is nice. Get to the back, really large opening for the uh, camera hole. And the flash is not being blocked off and it's actually recessed a little more and there's like an angled cut. So when that flash goes off, it won't bounce off the edge of this and it has like a nice black ring on there too. So that it kind of uh, prevents it from that flash bouncing into your image, which some cases have a problem with doing that. So guys, overall, I definitely recommend you checking out the Switch Easy Odyssey. It's a really cool looking case. It comes in a variety of different colors, black and red, white and gray. I don't know, there's probably a ton that I'm, I'm forgetting about. But there's a, a variety of different colors and you can also mix and match it because they always have a different second plate that comes with it as well. So go ahead and check it out. MyGearStore.com, $30 case. Totally recommend it. It's the perfect price point for the perfect device. And uh, it comes with a slew of extras that you get that are included with it as well. So mygearstore.com. Okay, guys, go check it out. If you personally own this product yourself, please post a comment below and tell, tell me what you, uh, what you think about it, how your experience has been with it. I'd love to hear what you have to say. I'll see you guys in the next video review. Till next time.